Hello everyone and welcome to the Ab Rocket Twister Intermediate Workout. I'm Janie and you'll be following me through this next class. We're going to get started with the Ab Chiseler. So go ahead and put your feet about shoulder width apart just like this. You're going to cross your arms over your shoulders, over your chest just like this and I want you to recline about halfway back and we're just going to do some basic crunches just like this and then after we do our set of eight, we're going to do eight pulses. Alright, so you guys ready for this? Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, good, three, two, one, pulse it, eight, feel it, seven, six, five, four, three, feel that crunch, and one, great, stretch it out, lean back, arms overhead, excellent, come back up again, holding the handles, guide yourself, feet positioned, Cross your arms. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five. Good. Four. Keep your head on the roller. Two and one. Here we go. Pulsing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Extend your legs. Stretch out those obliques and your abs. Excellent, now remember always keeping your core engaged in all of these exercises. Next, we're gonna do our power obliques. So go ahead and sit up. Now I want you to pretend like you have a ball in your hands, just like this. And basically the move is this, right here. We're gonna start with our left, going to the right. We're gonna do eight of them. When we end over here, we're gonna do some pulses. Now we're gonna add a leg to it. So you're gonna bend your knee, and this is the basic move, just like this. I want you reclined back about so far so that you're feeling your abs engage. I'm feeling them working right now. So here we go with our first set. Here we go to the left. One, good, twist. Three, four, five, really crunch. Seven, eight, good, here we go. Pulse and pulse. Bring that knee in, good. Four, three, really crunch. And one, excellent, back, stretch. We're gonna do a full set of eight again, and this time we're gonna pulse on our right side. So go ahead and come up halfway, hold your ball, starting from the left, knee up, crunch. Good. Three, four, you can do it. Five, six, seven, eight, crunch to the right. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Oh, great job, guys. Stretch it out. Ooh, make sure you breathe. We tend to forget to do that sometimes. <laughs> All right, next, we're gonna go ahead and go into our long arm crunch. Now, your arms are gonna be in a triangle. You'll have your hands right over just like this, and then you're gonna just lean back, feet planted, and you're just gonna come up just like this. All right, so here we go, eight counts, and we're gonna do some pulses at the end. Here we go, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, pulse it, eight, seven, six, five, four, feeling your abs, two, and one, stretch. Great. Let's do another set of those. You have eight to go with eight pulses. Here we go. Hands straightened out. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. You did it. Great. Stretch it out. Whew. Now we're gonna go ahead and do some bad boys that we like to call jackknives. Now you're already in this position, so basically the move here is you're gonna come up, your body will come up, and your feet are gonna be pointed, and you're in a V, just like that. Since the jackknife is a pretty difficult move, we have a modification, which I'll show you really quick. You're just gonna extend back, and you're gonna do one leg at a time, just like that. Make sure you do the full eight counts. You guys ready to do this? Let's extend, recline all the way. Get your hands over your shoulders, just like that. You guys ready for this? We're gonna do four, take a break, and then go back into the four. Go. Four. 
three, two, and one. Rest, five, four, breathe, three, two, and here we go, four, three, two, and one. Excellent. We only need one set of those. I don't think we need two. <laughs> so our last and final move is the twist, but before we can do that, we need to make sure that we adjust our ab rocket twister. So you're gonna have to take the pin out so that you get that twisting action. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Excellent. Okay, so let me describe this move to you. Basically, you're gonna recline about halfway back, your feet are gonna be off the ground, and you're gonna twist, holding the handles side to side, really engaging those abs and really twisting, getting a good crunch right here on the obliques. So you're gonna start from the left, go to the right. Now, for those of you who wanna modify it, you're gonna sit up a little bit further, just like this, so you're more straight. Your feet are still off of the ground, going from left to right, so no recline, okay? You guys ready? Let's do this. We're gonna do two sets of eight. Feet off the ground, recline, left, right, left, right, three, four, five, feeling it, six, seven, eight, excellent, all right, feet down, stretch, good job, we're going to do one more set of those, and you are done, recline halfway up, feet on the ground, lift them, starting to the left, good, Two, three, twist, five, six. You can do it, it's almost done. Seven, and that was eight. You finished, you just completed the Ab Rocket Twister Intermediate Workout. You deserve a round of applause as well as my team. Good job, guys. We'll see you guys next time right here.